I've been trying to have a mid-morning snack <clears throat> recently because eating breakfast, I don't know, 5.36. I don't eat a big enough breakfast to like make it to 12 without just becoming ravenous. And then I stuff myself at lunch and then want to take a nap, which is not very productive. So I'm going to have a mid-morning snack to see if that'll help. All joking aside, yes, I would like to see my trailer. Do you have a spare set of keys? Good for you. Yeah, I have a spare set. They're just over at Coffee World. I'll get them for you, but Yaku and I have to head to Bright Falls. The spare keys are in the gift shop safe. I'll call ahead and uh, have someone get them out for you. Oh, the road's flooded. But if you just follow this trail behind me, it'll lead you there. Call the gift shop so they can give Saga a hand. Yep. All right. Nothing? What am I paying them for? Guess they're busy. Oh, a bit of it. Well, after they finally pick up, we really need to get over. There's Coffee the World. That, uh, need to get across the river. Yep. You keep a jar of nuts in your desk. Yeah. I like nuts with it. They're just slacking. Easy to snack on and a good amount of calorie dense. But we'll probably go in the bar. was that? Can't be good. Fuck! Is that a throwing axe? What the heck was that? It was a bloody throwing axe. All right. Not to bad on the calories with fiber and protein. Yep. Yeah, I like mixed nuts are good. Some peanuts, some cashews, some almonds, some walnuts. What else? There's some macadamia. Whoa, it was fast. The goal this game eludes you, it's where, it's really a sort of a, an interactive story, isn't it? And we're just kind of playing along. We're trying to stop, we're trying to stop, stop some evil from uh, doing evil things. I guess is the simplest way to put it. Pecans, pistachios, mm, yeah, pistachios. I do like pistachios. Yeah, their evil is afoot in Bright Falls. But it's kind of the story is kind of told in the form of a, a mystery that the FBI agent has to kind of unravel. into 
taken. Evil is afoot with the caffeine fueled speed. Or the That's true. Or Must be pounding the uh, espressos, giving them super speed. This is a shortcut. I kind of want to follow along the trail. We can get back over here. Let's see what's on the trail first. I need that. That's for sure. It's too tall for me to jump. There's another cult stash. Oh gosh, I just had a giant mind fart. Hold on. This is a memory game. <laughs> we'll do it again. Holy crap, will it not show it to you more than once? <laughs> I'd like my brain to shut off when I was watching that. I will show it to you again, otherwise. Okay, we can restart it. Restart with... Am I crazy here? What uh, key is that? Can I not restart it? It says restart. I know it's like this one, this one, this one, and oh, yeah, okay. I guess we can do it that way. What was the last one? There we go, okay. <laughs> Thank you, brain. <laughs> Trial and error. Found another dead taken over by the radio tower. It looked like it had been bashed to death. There was a lunchbox and some weird knitting by the corpse, too. I took care of the body, but there's a third one this month. Everyone keep your eyes peeled. We need to find this guy and let him know the cult of the tree means business. Yeah, I feel like the cult is fighting the... The taken. Which is weird.
Yeah, I was expecting there to be three lights, not four, and my brain just like decided to shut off after the third light. I was like, oh, you're done. There was more. Oh, do we need, what do we need here? Screwdriver? Or a key. Watery hunting shack. Hey, if you take the crossbow out, put it back in the stash when you're done. So we need three numbers. So there's some numbers here. If you take the crossbow out, put it back in the stash when you're done. P.S. I changed the code as asked. Let's try five to Yes! Puzzled. Ooh. Crossbow. Do <laughs> do. All right. Another bolts. Another bolts.
Um, I need to, I need to, let's see. <clears throat> Sir. Oh, right. Hmm. Crossbow, not messing around. And you can retrieve the arrows. Heck yeah. Reload, not great though. Right between the eyes. So this path takes us to the radio tower. Okay, so let's just see what's up here. Oh, this is another one of those puzzles. Let's see. Three little deer ventured to Rome and found a nice place to eat and play. One little deer never came home and two of the deers cried all day. Doesn't make sense. Three little deer ventured to Rome. Doesn't look right. Huh. So what changed? Oh gosh, wolf scared the crap out of me. Are there two? I think there may be two.
Oh, I'm not getting my bolt back, am I? Sorry, pup. Maybe you have my bolt. Come on. I thought I hit him with the bolt, maybe I did not. What's another charm? My inventory is full? Really? Um, <clears throat> let's see. Pain medication restores small health quickly and replenishes health, additional health over time. Yeah, let's go ahead and use our painkillers. A charm. Deer charm. All right, what does this do? Increased resilience against being staggered or interrupted. Uh, yeah, let's do that. I don't use flares much yet. Another one of those lunch boxes. All right. I lowered my rifle standing on the car's roof. I looked out at the carnage. The zombies had almost won, but luckily I was here. Heroes are sometimes the people we least expect them to be. Now my time with town was finally safe, thanks to me. I slung into the hot piece of iron over my shoulder one more time, hopefully for the last time. The townspeople cautiously emerging from the hiding places surveying the same carnage I saw, and cheered my name, and I waved, and they cheered again. <laughs> now I could finally get back to my quiet, unassuming life, reading books, and gardening, and fiber crafts, and being the world's top mycology expert. <laughs> I mean, I... Suddenly, a hand seized my wrist. I looked into the eyes of the sweet, sensitive writer I had known since childhood. A smile spread across... Uh, his beautiful, kind face, and I felt at peace for the first time since the zombies had emerged. You did it. I knew you could. Now we can live in peace together for the rest of our days. I mean, that's, that's got a happy ending, I suppose. That's nice. Uh, You know, it's a story about a uh, zombie slaying mycologist. Okay. Um, twelve. So minimal. What the? Oh, doggy, seriously. Just healed. Can't tell if he's gonna be following me or not.
Let's see. Bolts lodged into enemies will attract bullets fired near them. Interesting. Increase magazine size. Land two headshots in quick succession to stun an enemy for an extended duration. Um, let's go for more bullets. Saga had lost count of how many shots she'd fired, but she was sure it must have been more than she had in her magazine. And yet, she'd not run out of ammo. As if the magazine had grown to fit more bullets, she fired again. Cool. At least we're getting more pages now at once. Another Alex Casey lunchbox? Hi, Hero. I think a few pieces of paper from my private fan fiction project got mixed into some of these stashes, but I don't know which ones. I posted some online and they're getting pretty good reviews, but I'd appreciate if you don't read them. It's a privacy thing. Okay. Uh, Ranger cabin. Can we get to this? Mm. No. Well, they've lost some of their ride cars. Whatever they are. Floats, things, boats. That is blocked off. Let's go. I love the atmosphere of this game, but I also wish I could just see more stuff. <laughs> I also wish it wasn't so dark and dreary. It's a double-edged sword.
So can I not store these charms? No. I guess so. I don't know that. I mean, there's only one option just to move them. Mm -mm. All right. That frees up some spots. Hello? Anyone here? Nope. Did they get out? Did the Taken get them? Or were they turned into Taken? I'll need to get the key to the trailer park myself. Find out next time on Dragon Ball. He's kept in the gift shop safe. <sighs> Let's see. Coffee world, the most caffeinated place on earth, and yet nobody's here to help me get that key. Six more, wow. <laughs> DBZ episode, five episodes of standing in the arena before the fight begins. I know, right? <laughs> yeah. Ah, strange dolls. Who wants to start watching One Piece with you? Aren't there like <clears throat> a thousand plus episodes of that? Wait, 5,000? <laughs> Holy crap. I didn't know it was that, it was that many. I barely made it through bleach. And I thought I Let's see. Coffee World. Fresh Pot Gift Shop. Locked. Need something to jimmy it open with. 
Okay, there were a thousand plus. Just be, Google just to be sure. A list of maintenance work. Let's see. Sign defaced again. Clean with detergent. Wax sign should be good until someone tags is good tomorrow. Slow roaster pot is stuck. Won't swing. Hit it with some WD-40. Seems to be good now. Falling free near Latte Lagoon. Should probably call the tree guy. Chainsaw and removed. Keeping the wood. Burned out bulbs on the percolator. Replaced with bulbs. A screwdriver. Huh. Hey, the lock is jammed again. I forced it with a screwdriver, which has disappeared again. Put shit back when you use it. The 5,000 thing must have been a meme. Hmm. Yeah, I mean, I get, yeah, 5,000, that's, that would be insane. I mean, a 1,000 plus is insane as it is. All the bathrooms are out of order. Uh-oh. It's a bad, you're drinking all that coffee, it's a bad... It's a bad combo. Alright, so we need a screwdriver. Days of our lives in General Hospital of over 14,000. Yeah, how many years have those shows been going on? The decades at this point, right? Espresso Express, the percolator. The theme park seen better days. Agent Ed. Must be locked from the other side. How's it going? Game is gorgeous, it is. Yeah, it looks it's really good. It did a lot. A very good job with this game. Both visually and story wise. Gameplay is okay. It's it's you know it's Definitely has sort of a slow burn survival horror setup, but it's fun. I feel like I'm about to be attacked, but I just don't know. Just getting that feeling. No power. Must be a fuse box around here somewhere. Uh, we've been playing it, what, we're about eight hours in, eight plus hours. Gonna ask if you need to play the first one to get the story. I would. The story in these games is really sort of deep and dense. It kind of gives you a, like a brief overview a bit. Yeah, but I would definitely, the first one's a good game. So I would definitely play the first one if you could. If you watched every episode nonstop without commercials, it would take you 438 days to watch them all. That's crazy. So where does this power cable go?
You could skip the DLC for the first one, but... Regenerator? So Ooh. A fuse is missing. Oh, of course. Can't operate the ride without it. Look for a fuse in the Cavalier Knight's workshop. Okay. I think what? The remastered version of the first Alan Wake is on the Epic Store. I think it's an exclusive, unfortunately, but. All right, so where's their workshop? Knight's Workshop, okay. Can't be opened on this side. So we need to find another way in to the Hall of Knights. The giant wall. Hmm. The remaster not on Steam. Yeah, I feel like Epic. I feel like they may have published the remaster or paid for it somehow. So what, do we need to go out the front door here and around? And then I bet we can go through the gate? Yeah, okay, so let's go out the front gate. Oh, that's a, an actual well, okay. Ooh, what do we got here? Another cult stash? Um, what hides behind the smile? Yeah, Epi I mean, the Alan Wake 2 was published by Epic Games Publishing, so my guess is this game will... I would not be surprised if it ever comes to Steam, or if at least doesn't remain on the Epic Store for years, so... Epic is think they can squeeze all their money out of it from their store <clears throat> and then they might put it on Steam but I guess it's, it's going to be a while probably which sucks what behind hides behind the smile is that one of their like mascot things what hides behind the smile we need to find some teeth some large teeth. Where did I see some large teeth? <laughs> There's some large teeth. When you ask, Maricetta will speak. I feel like there's a lot of, there's like all these dog puns going on with his name. Dog jokes. All right, so behind the teeth, let's see. Uh, Mocha the Moose. One morning during Coffee World's construction, a wounded moose was discovered taking shelter inside the Fresh Pot gift shop. Though limping from a leg injury, the wily moose proved too quick for wildlife rescue. You know, man, I don't, you don't get informed if games aren't released on Steam. You only knew about the Dead Island 2 for months after release.
After a long and unsuccessful chase, everyone stopped for a much-needed coffee break. Of course they did. Brewing up some of Coffee World's finest, before a cup was poured, the moose appeared drawn by the delicious aroma. He allowed himself to be treated in exchange for a steaming mug of the now known as Mocha's signature blend. Find that highly unlikely. A moosing mocha fact. Mocha is around six years old. Did you know a moose could live up to 25 years? Mocha weighs 820 pounds. Did you know a moose is the largest species of deer in the world? Mocha loves to swim. Did you know moose can dive up to 20 feet underwater? Really? I did not know that. Mocha's favorite drink is coffee. Did you know that Mocha is the only known moose with a caffeine addiction? Okay. We do now. Behind the teeth. There's the key. I <laughs> swear so that animal just might be drowning. Yeah, 20 feet seems... Like, how would they measure that? Can you imagine if, like, you're a diver underwater and suddenly see a moose down there with you? It's like, no. Something is wrong here. <laughs> something is very much wrong here. All right, let me go unlock that thing. That's a big animal. All right, Coffee World stash key. Ooh, nine minute bullets, 12 gauge, and some bolts. M and T were supposed to be on patrol last night, but didn't show. If anyone hears anything from them, let me know. All right, nice. Caffeine moose versus cocaine bear. The more epic battle than, than Godzilla has ever had. <laughs> don't give uh don't give many ideas. See that's gonna be a, the next sci-fi channel movie. It's a flare, okay. With a, like, with a guest appearance from Sharknado. All right, percolator, I think this is the right way. getting there wait can we go through no I wish it just told me what the point of interest was this is like did have I seen it <laughs> Shark NATO from the Pacific meets Moose NATO from the from Canada. Whoever wins, we lose. You can hear some sci-fi exec scribbling on his notepad madly. Yes. Um. Uh, uh. Too much you can't use them from the ground. 
You should watch Cocaine Bear. Uh, I'm just going to use this. You've seen most of the Sharknados. <laughs> no, the fact that there's more than one, you know. There are five of them, you think. Jesus! <laughs> Calm down, Saga. It's just a pot of coffee. <laughs> You have the movie on your watch list for, for Wild Janed? The trailer is wild, yeah. I have not seen it, but I did watch the trailer. No more bolts. We max out on bolts? We are max out on bolts, Bummer. Ah, uh, do I want to... Yeah, next time we find a shoebox. Okay then. Imagine if Yogi Bear was on cocaine. <laughs> and it was after your picnic basket. Oh, you threw two. Okay, you yeah, have friends. I got him in his shoulder. All right, apparently I suck with the crossbow. Okay, <laughs> do it that way. Oh, he disappeared with my bolt. Dang it. Oh, there's one. I guess he left it. Oh, that's a screwdriver. Hey, this should get that gift shop open. Oh my gosh, we've got so many options now. Restock our bolts here. Um, let's use something in the way. Yeah, when you hit that red part, that just kind of 
Their skin just blows off, doesn't it? Okay. Nope. He was very fast. Well, I'm pressing the wrong button. Had a run on shoes on, apparently. Do I just first aid here? Ah, uh, yeah, let's just full first aid. You like Epic's achievement sound? I've, I've found it, this game, like it pops up at times where like the game is being super, a super serious moment and suddenly you get this like, boop, pink, chown, this happy little achievement noise and you're like, it just doesn't feel right, you know? But I've not heard the 360s, unless you're being sarcastic. <laughs> You actually like it? I mean, it's definitely a nice sort of positive noise, but also compared to the Steam achievements, like the Steam achievements come up on like the lower, you know, right in the corner. The Epic ones pop up like right almost in the middle of your screen, like in the upper half of your screen and they're big and animated. It's like first the picture appears and then like the text slides in and then, the, then it goes out the same way. Just, it's a little too much, in my opinion. And I'm finding that the noise kind of out of place in this game, but. Safe. Hey, Ilmo, heads up. Got another angry voicemail from a parent about her kid poking himself in the eye with one of those souvenir pukas. Whose grand idea was it to sell kids plastic knives in a coffee-themed amusement park anyway? Oh, it was yours. Jeff, I need another moose favor. Moko's doing just fine, but even but he even got a going vet report, and then bam, they say he has a heart attack. I'm not blaming you. Maybe he just had a bad ticker. No tolerance for stimulants either. Hmm. We're telling the kids Mocha's taking a little vacation, but I could really use your help ASAP to maintain con continuity. Do you have any more in stock? Ilmo. Interesting. Locked. Okay. What would Ilmo use for a code? Why did you change the damn password on the safe again? I thought it was lookout fixer supplier. Who hurts you? Why are you so paranoid? Lookout Fixer Supplier. Calm down, this one's easy. Tracker Lookout Cleaner.
Tracker Lookout Cleaner. I don't know. Hmm. Tracker Lookout Cleaner. I need to open the safe. What's the combination? People hate the puzzle, Zuma. Why not just use keys? People love the puzzles, Yaku. Only very smart people can think up good puzzles. Just look around and you will find the answer. Dedicated staff will be rewarded. The combination to the safe is somewhere in the gift shop. Okay. Tracker Lookout Cleaner. Gift shop is not very big. Not very big at all. What's some more pie? Hmm. Coffee World staff. Hope they're not all monsters now. The photos have stickers on them. Tracker Lookout Cleaner. Tracker. Lost and found, maybe? You say lost and found is a tracker? Security caregiver, lookout cleaner. We'll say Victor is the cleaner. Lookout. Park walk around? One, two, six. Let's try one, two, six. And then we can. No. It is tracker lookout cleaner tracker. You missed the bit. I know, right? That was that was the that was the ultimate uh, puzzle right there. Spell it out in lights. Tracker lookout cleaner. Lookout. Who would lookout be? A lookout. So lookout could be security. So it could be four, six. What will be the first one? Tracker. Tracker. Yeah, okay. The keys to my trailer. Now to find the clicker and the colt. So we need a fuse box. Or a fuse. We've got to get into the... The knight's workshop. Little wolf? Please don't be a wolf. Mm. 
Nailed him. Oh, where's my bolt? You bastard. Feel like it's sticking out of your neck, maybe? Can't get it. No. Alright, I still think we need to go outside the outside the park. So this way? Exit. See you latte. I suppose that was inevitable, wasn't it? Oh no, I'm I'm to where you are. <laughs> All right, well, I don't want you to be spoiled, so I understand. You're going super slow and enjoying the game 100%. It's probably your favorite for this year. Yeah, I would say, I would say that. It's true for me as well. It's been a lot of fun. Good luck, and you'll try to get ahead tonight. All right, sounds good, dude. What's down here? That goes to the crossing. That was blocked, wasn't it? Can we go to the lighthouse? No, that's blocked. Although the map says the workshop is also blocked. Well, we're closer to the workshop. Let's go see that first. And if that's blocked, we'll try the trailer. We do. We need bolt cutters. All right, that shortcut's unlocked. Good. This is kind of disturbing. I wonder if that's... It must be a glitch on those balloons. It's weird. More of those kids' lunch boxes. Where? Welcome back, and boy, do we have some breaking news that's sure to knock your socks off. Davis.
this family beef jerky will now be available at the Sunday market in three delicious flavors. That's right. Our favorite sponsor, Davis Family Beef Jerky, can now be enjoyed in smoked hickory, teriyaki, and hickory teriyaki. <laughs> Hickory teriyaki. Guess that does. Sometimes it go well together or not. Where did it say that lot lunchbox was? Well, let's see. We probably got some more evidence here. Don't need to go over all this again. Yep. Already got the answers to these. Nice. Mulligan and Thornton, really? Those are the deputies, right? Let's see. <laughs> All right, let me take a another quick bio break and we will try to get into this place. Okay, so we need a fuse. They need to speed up this map loading. Everything else is super smooth, but the maps, like, I don't know. Oh, there's a locked door there. We need the um, <clears throat> bolt cutters, don't we? Maybe we need to be doing this in the order that's, uh, listed on our goals. I don't know. All right, I guess we go across the street to the trailer park.
The page said I'd run into a cultist here. On your toes, Saga. All right, shoebox. What should we store? Mayor Setter is not afraid of the rough questions. Mayor Setter is not afraid of the rough questions. Weird. Take it out. Arm it out. It's in the rain. Must not drink the water. Take a bath ever again. <clears throat> moonshine. Only drink the moonshine, brother. Ah! Is that Thor and Odin? Don't look like cultists. Feel like myself. Don't know how to fight it. Uh, we're too old. No. Excuse oh. me. I'm looking for the Anderson trailer. What? Sweetie pie, right on time. Like we were just saying, it's not true. The lies to hurt you. And make you weak. Don't believe a word. They believe because deep down, they want to be told what to think. We're different. Rebels! You must stop it before it turns real. Don't be part of the story. Make the story. <laughs> Not the hell of it! <laughs> These old drunks don't seem affected by the horror story like the other locals are. Do they know what's happening here? How do you know about the story? Same as you, of course, sweetie pie. We are family. The Andersons. Vikings. Gods. So good. To finally see you, Saga. I am your great uncle Odin, and this is your long lost Murfar, Tor. Sarasoga. He is your grandfather, and I am the old father. <laughs> Just as crazy as everyone else. Just as caught in it. I need to stay focused. I need to check out the trailer. You have things to do, sweetie pie. We don't want to keep you from your business. You can come see us anytime. At our refuge in Valhalla. Nursing home. And another lunchbox. This one say you can overcome adversity and achieve your goals. It's good. It's a good message. Man, Odin and they've let themselves go. Let themselves go. Do you think we missed Audie's show? Who cares? That depressing tango shit is 
bad for your head, bro. Oh, do I have enough? Uh, 12. So we could do, you know what? I'm going to wait. I'm going to save it. Get one of the bigger upgrades. special guest today on the program. It's artisan cuckoo clock designer Terry Feldman. Terry, how are we today? Hey there, Pat. Doing just fine. I'm a super big fan of the show. What a treat to be on with you today. Oh, the pleasure's all mine, Terry. <laughs> now, I hear you're doing something special for Deerfest. Tell us about that. Uh, yeah, yeah. I'm crafting a selection of custom Basswood cuckoo clock. But the real special talk is when it's cuckoo time and you're expecting an urn to pop out for a church. Oh, yeah. Well, that's just me. Ooh, this place is bigger than I thought and flooded. attractive martial arts master it's me your brother Ilmo <laughs> I now recognize you but Ilmo why are you dressed like that deer fest is almost here which means we're <laughs> chopping the prices on all of our custom designed deer fest parade floats floats created by the award-winning team at Kalevala Knights Motorcycle Club winners of the last year's trophy for best deer fest float featuring an animal that is not deer that very team and you're gonna get a kick <laughs> out of our latest float designs <laughs> we've done it all deer fest floats restaurant floats floats shaped like things we can't show on television <laughs> what our floats are the best way to impress your friends propose to your partner or throw shade at an office colleague and we don't do just deer fest our floats are a perfect gift for weddings birthdays and bar mitzvahs or your gonna search Scenario. Our floats will punch up any special occasion. <laughs> but why take our word for it? Let's hear it from one of our many, many happy customers. I was at Deer Fest last year. Floats were pretty good. One of them was a squad. And that was stuff people liked it. And there you have it. Award-winning floats now at reduced prices that will... <laughs> Knock you off your feet! Ah! Order yours today! <laughs> oh, all right. I feel like I'm dueling uh, subtitles there for a while. You were a handsome deer. Leave us behind every chapter. 
Anderson 2. All right, let's see. Reeks of booze. Addressed to me. From years ago. Wake was right. The horror story is changing reality. Not just people's memories. Washington Power. Overdue. Yeah, that looks, that looks like some... Some tasty pizza. Maybe it was tasty pizza. Everything here reminds me of Logan. This could be her room. This is getting too real, too personal. I was eating something a couple weeks ago and I was like, I was halfway through and I noticed like, oh, this is starting to mold. I think it was some bread product. I was like, man. <laughs> Should have double checked, but to Logan, keep on shining, little rock star. Your proud great granddad and your great grand uncle. My newfound relatives, cozy with the cult of the tree, and that's the clicker in the hands of the cult, just like the page promised. Carly Vala Knights. That's the motorcycle club the Costello brothers are in. I'll take Odin and Tor up on their offer and visit their nursing home right after I find this biker workshop. No. It's not true. It's just a fucking story. It's not true. Logan's back home. She's fine. Fuck. She's at school. David. I'm in the story and it's coming true. Wake said Scratch would try and hurt me with the horror story. But he said there's still time to stop this. That he can stop this with a clicker. Hey, this is David. Leave a message. David? Is Logan okay? Call me back as soon... Oh. I think they got him. This is a big cross, though. Can I go in this water? Mulligan is a cultist? What the fuck is going on here? E no. Okay. Finish if there's any loot in this place, and then we'll go out. Flashlight go. A pun book from Ilmo. Are we close in the story? That might explain some of his behavior. Did I leave the bureau in this fictional reality? Hmm. 
No, that is not going on the board. Uh, let's see. Photo of Torn Odin with cultists. Hmm. Lunchbox. All right. Good? I think we're good. Bon. Logan used to love her music. The Nordic Tales book Mom gave to Logan when she was little. Logan's junior agent certificate. So cute. So cute. All right, I think we've gotten everything. Oh, those are kind of disturbing, actually. So it's Torn Odin. She's playing video games. And uh, there's one of like, the Deer Fest and the Coffee World. Oh, no, it's the Moose. It's Mocha. <laughs> the Coffee World. Okay. Cool. It's like a Stanley Kubrick made a video game. All right, so we need to go to the workshop. But I need bolt cutters, so I'm going to do that. Wind's picking up. Why would you put that there? <laughs> oh, I thought I was going into a safe space. It violated the, my... <laughs> oh, man. Okay. Hmm. Violated my trust. <laughs> Ooh. Oh, crap. Um... Twelve o'clock. Can we? Is there another save place near the conversation? New choices. I don't think there are any more conversations to be had here. I think Thor and Odin peaced out. Then we're back inside. Or did I miss some dialogue? I think they're gone. This is my place. Huh. No bolt cutters either. That's what I'm. That's what I'm concerned about. I 
All right. It was there a save place? Lunchbox. So there was a lunchbox there. Where the heck was it? All right, let's try to get the let's try to get the fuse. I'm getting sucked in. Yeah, these games, I think I've jump scared. <laughs> well, I haven't jump scared that hard yet. But, uh... <laughs> oh! You think I'd expect it by now, but... <laughs> this is the workshop from the photo with the cultists. This is where they had the clicker. If it's still here, I need to find it. I also need to find the bolt cutters. Donut. Music is making me nervous. Something's about to happen, but all right. Let's see here. Thanks for the valuable input. I'm assuming this means Saturday Night Sauna is on. Sauna is good for the body and good for the soul. You may not like it, but it likes you. Can't find the new door lock combination. Look inside the smiley coffee cup. It doesn't help me. Let's see. Sauna, sauna, float work, paycheck. Still haven't received our paychecks. Stop taking the OOP out of the assembly hall. If you want to get drunk in the workshop, fine, but the OOP is for ritual use only. I've seen some of you place our stashes in the open. Please don't do that, you rascals. So yeah, they have to be cult members. Lock combination. 
Look inside the smiley coffee cup doesn't help me. All right, so there's a combo lock. Look inside the smiley coffee cup. Smiley coffee cup. There's a smiley coffee cup. I didn't look to see what kind of combination it was. It may be a triangle combination. Uh, all right, so we got pointing. All right, we got vertical, angle, and opposites. Locked. They must be in there. There has to be a way to get this lock open. Was the other way around. It was. The other way around. Ooh. This is the cult hideout. Their headquarters, even. That's a, it's very cultish. <laughs> yeah, these guys aren't evil. I just they're they're weirdos, but they're not evil. There's a basement. Ooh. Maybe they are evil. They have a basement. You know what that means. The light switch you found washed up at the lake is not junk. It's fucking important. Trust me on this. From now on, whenever we catch a target, we're going to cut his heart out, stick this in thing inside it, and flick it. I know it sounds weird, but just trust me. It'll be like a ritual. This is going to work. The Nightingale ritual wasn't completed. Interesting. They didn't, yeah, because they were interrupted. didn't get a chance to do it. The cult isn't well organized. <laughs> People aren't following orders. The cult is leaving supplies around for themselves. I've offered the Mac like you ask all these stashes by your last count locked and loaded and ready to go. This will be handy. That's it. Well, these are all the stash locations. Okay. This is the cult's process. Their ritual. Their ritual. Let's see, I'm not trying to play the blame game, but we cannot let random tourists walk into the one of our rituals. We stopped before we cut, you got to use the clicker. Hell, the lights weren't even set up yet. It's unacceptable. So let's look at the learnings. We need to be faster with our setups. We need to be 100% positive. Someone is on lookout duty. Communication, communication, communication. Slip ups like, this is why we have FBI agents snooping around, which is not great. I'm only being harsh because I know we can do better. Whoever's been sabotaging lake house equipment. Exactly. You know, cults these days. If they can't uh, control their members, what are they? It's the mobs. Let's see. If you're looking to help the cult, this is not it. Unless bringing the feds down on us is what you consider helpful, which in this case you can... Fuck right off. Stay away from the FBC, and if you see them poking around again, report to the Grand Master. Let's see. Ritual for taken. Surround the target. Subdue them. Use hammer or other blunt object. Restrain them. Carve out their hearts. Recite the words. Put the clicker into their chest. Flick it twice to make sure it works. Hmm. <laughs> Remember the floodlights on tripods. We need to see what we're doing. Always work in pairs. Flick it twice to make sure it works. I am. I feel like they're just kind of making this up as they go. Mm -hmm. 
Let's see. I wish there was a sword button. This is kind of all over the place. All right, chat, this is where we part ways. You're going to save the spooky basement for tomorrow. I want to have plenty of time to enjoy it. Oh, this game is getting good, getting intense. It's like we're building up to something crazy. Today's Thursday, right? Yeah. My guess is we won't finish the game tomorrow, especially if we've got stashes to find. Let me go get this lunchbox. Where is this freaking lunchbox? Or I forget. It says it's right in the corner there. Also a stash in there. All right, where are you lunchbox? Oh, walked right by it. I know. Six fragments. We got enough for a big upgrade, I think, now. We have 18. We do. Oh, what do we want? Crossbow. Fires two bolts before it needing to be reloaded. It's a maybe. Reload speed. Kills restore enemy health. What am I doing? I'm pressing the wrong buttons. That's what I'm doing. I think we go for two bolts. Saga realized the crossbow could hold two shots at the same time. Had she just not noticed before? Or had the weapon changed somehow? Like in a dream. Cool. All right, nice. We can grab the stash. Unless the stash is on the other side of this wall. Which it might be. It might be on the other side. So I don't like it's in the dryers. All right, ah, man, I wish I had more time. I wish I had more time. One of the things I'm hoping in the new year is that we can do, we can maybe like add another hour to the stream. I need to sort out my food situation so I don't starve. You know, like have, have lunch during the stream. would be very helpful. But that's one of my, one of my new year's goals. Yeah, I need to, I basically need to get some, have some food prepped. Because right now there, I have nothing prepared. I'm not even sure what food is in the house. But yeah, basically I can, eating, eating on stream would be fine. I just need to have something prepared so I can, I can eat it. Because right now I'm not sure what I'm having for lunch. Yeah, I have, I have no, I have no idea. It'll be a surprise. <laughs> 